We got a call at the pawn shop. Somebody had a old vintage Donkey Kong arcade game. It's a video game. Chum's my sidekick. Might as well bring him with me. Come on in. This is my uh, weird media room, and you know, this is Donkey Kong, but as you can see, it doesn't really fit the motif of the room. No, with the not at all. Killer clowns. We got a dead pig carcass on the ground. We got Ouija boards. And then we have Donkey Kong. <laughs> Definitely a little odd. I do have some sentimental value with the game. I mean, it's a neat piece. It's a good conversation piece. I just need to get something that makes more sense in my room of horror. Donkey Kong's just not scary enough for me. So where'd you end up getting it? My company's partners with Circus Circus. We lease out their theme park. I was begging and pleading with them one day, and they finally agreed to sell me a couple games, and this was one of the games they sold me. Oh, wow. And just the history of the game itself. Before his name was Super Mario, before he was a plumber, his name was Jumpman, and that was his pet gorilla. That was his really? girlfriend. Yeah. And then one day, the gorilla got pissed off, kidnapped his girlfriend, and I guess started throwing barrels at him. He had to jump over the barrels and climb the ladders to get up and save her. One of the most influential games ever. Started the Mario Brothers, boosted Nintendo to what it is today. I had no idea. I just knew it was a cool game. So uh, can we play it and check yeah, it out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know you're supposed to jump, right? No, no idea that you had to jump, Joe. Lame. Shut up, Joe. All right. Um, tell me, man, what are you looking to do with it? I'd like to keep it, but my house is only so big. What are you looking to get out of it? I'd like to get 2,500 out of it. It is in great shape, though. I'll give you this. I don't know if Donkey Kong is the actual arcade game people are looking to get. Or let me have a friend of mine come over, check it out, see what he thinks it's worth. Sure. Do me a favor, go call Nick. Yep. I'm gonna stay here and play it. I'm actually welcoming an expert today because I want to know some stuff about the game too, and I want to make sure that it is all really original. I really want to get Nick down here and make sure it's not a bootleg, because sometimes when these things are too good to be true, they most of the time are. Well, here it is, wow. Yeah, it took a lot of my lunch money back in high school. Good old Donkey Kong. Yeah, this is the game that uh, gave Namco a run for its money, because Namco was the king in America with Pac-Man. And then when Shigeru Miyamoto came out with this, Nintendo basically conquered America with selling just as many of these as they did as Pac-Man. There's a lot of bootlegs and reproductions of this game, but what's really going to matter about as far as value goes is if it's all original. Well, do your work. All righty. What are you looking for? Well, I'm looking for serial numbers. And I'm looking for a TKG serial number on the board, because that makes a difference on whether it's a bootleg or if it's a real Donkey Kong. I have your answer. This is an original Donkey Kong cabinet. Nice. So what's it worth retail? OK, because it's original, and the board's original, it's got original monitor and original joystick, and they are sought after in original condition, somewhere between six to $800. That's it? That's it. Not quite what you're looking for. No. They it's... made a lot of these. It's not rare. <sighs> well, Nick, thanks a lot, man. Hey, you're welcome. There's really not much market for video arcade games, because most of the people nowadays, they're looking for you know 60 to 400 games packed in, into one cabinet. All right, man, so this is always a tough one for me because you you wanted 2,500 bucks. On a good day, retail is gonna be 800. I mean, I can offer you 300 bucks for it? No, no, I wouldn't. I've got, I've got to double my money. If I went up to four, would it change your mind at all? No, no, I, it's too cool a piece to sell for four. I wouldn't, wouldn't be able to do it. I totally 100% understand, my man. Um, Thanks a lot. Hope you find room yeah. for it. The offer is way lower than I thought. So, you know, I get to keep the Donkey Kong game and, uh, you know, better luck next time. <laughs>